I'm so sick of looking at absolute horror on the internet and people getting away with it, much less being celebrated for it. Marin Morris with a strong message for Jason Aldean's wife, Brittany, after getting into it over their positions on trans rights. It was just like, I didn't really think I woke up and chose violence today. It all started when Brittany showed this video showing her before and after glam. In the caption, she writes, I'd really like to thank my parents for not changing my gender when I went through my tomboy phase. I love this girly life. That started a mixed string of reactions. Madison LaCroix, Ray Lynn, and Laura Trump showed their support. But Cassidy Pope, she firmly disagreed, writing, You'd think celebs with beauty brands would see the positives in including LGBTQ plus people in their messaging, but instead, here we are hearing someone compare their tomboy face to someone wanting to transition. Real nice. I wish I could bring you down Just for a second Teach you a lesson Marin saw Cassidy's comment and wasted no time adding her two cents. Strong words, again, aimed at Britain. It's so easy to, like, not be a scumbag human. Sell your clip-ins and zip it, Insurrection Barbie. Oof. And it didn't take long before both Marin and Britney's husbands weighed in. Britney's husband, Jason, played off Marin's dig and called Britney, my Barbie. Meanwhile, Marin's man, Ryan Hurd, addressed the drama on Twitter with a lengthy message, praising his wife for sticking up for others and dissing Britney for her comments. Quote, scoring quick points by picking on trans kids isn't something that is brave at all. I think it's cool to like know where you stand with somebody. Yeah. And that, that's a really neat thing. But despite all the back and forth drama, Britney's still doubling down on her stance. Writing on her Instagram story, some parents want to be accepted by society so badly that they're willing to make life-altering decisions for their children who aren't old enough to fully comprehend the consequences of those actions. And Marin, she's not done yet either. Y'all have been so sweet and supportive today um, of me and Cassidy. I will say, like, we can handle this shit. We've dealt with idiots, you know, for years, you know, saying insanely stupid stuff at us, but, like, Check on your trans friends, check on your gay friends, anyone that like is in country music and had to look at that bullshit today and feel subhuman. Marin showed E.T. that same fire in April at the Grammys when she opened up about the importance of inclusivity, especially in country music. You have been so outspoken about diversity in country music, and now we are really seeing it. You're one of the people who will push it forward. What does that mean to you now? Well, I mean, it's not just me. Like, it's, it's a lot of our friends that believe in that. And so, yeah, looking at the representation getting better in the genre is, is so special. So I feel like I just, I'm sort of like a byproduct of it. I'm not the cause, but I, I'm just so proud of where it's headed.